Hey everyone, it's Adam here. In this video, um, we're going to be installing the Tenere 700 Color Clusters mod. All this is doing is um, making your your uh, display, computer display on the Tenere 700 um, prettier, in my opinion. Um, so just getting into it, I'm going to narrate this uh, as voiceover. So we're um, starting by um, unscrewing uh, these two bolts to kind of free the dash from its bracket. Um, and then those of you who don't have T7s, you can kind of see that, you know, hey, it's a it's a pretty bright display. Um, so you've got a yellow cover to kind of make that easier on the eyes. Then you have a yellow, red, and green Christmas tree in order to um, uh, simulate a MotoGP kind of tack that is you know, going up and turning more red as it gets higher. So we're moving these two. And then from there, you're going to um, pop off the display from the bracket, you can kind of see it's already popping itself off, up and out. And then behind, you're going to have um, a big cable that you're going to unhook after you take these, um, they're not quite Phillips head screws, out. It's just a simple squeezy, squeezy, lemon breezy. Once you're back on the, the bench, you uh, remove these um, Japanese spec, not really Phillips head screws. Um, from the back, there are six of them. No, sorry, eight of them to reveal the Tenere 700's main display. Uh, we hooked back up to the bike just to uh, mark off. We want the green, yellow, and the red with a, um, a marker that is not permanent. <laughs> and now uh, laying out the design of this and make sure that um, it's going to, you know, you want to measure twice and, and cut once. Um, we did have some trial and error through this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play through this. We did some trial and error here. There was a, an issue where you know you, we made the the green uh, line too narrow. It didn't cover the um, the numbers fully on the vertical line up the side of the display. And then we um, the, the the yellow one we didn't come over far enough to the right uh, for the display. So you know they give you enough paper where you could probably screw up five times. And so just um, you know take your time. Um, try it out, test fit it. For the yellow piece, uh, they give you four pieces of white tape that you can hold that to the back of the, um, the plastic frame. This, in my opinion, is the best upgrade, is the yellow cover. The Christmas tree thing I'm less excitable about, but um, I think the yellow cover is something that I would do to a Tenere 700 if, if this was my bike. Oh, it's, it's not my bike. <laughs> it's my friend's down the street. Uh, he asked me to come over and and film this uh, modification. So let's see how it looks on the bike now. Um, obviously putting these screws back in, all eight of them. The Japanese tend to, uh, and there's no Loctite on these, the Japanese tend to um, do a good job with fasteners. So you can see here how it looks. So you can see the numbers, how they come over. Um, back to, you know, my opinion here is that, and here's the, um, the RPMs going up. You can see the RPMs going up. Um, you know, back, back to, my opinion, the yellow cover looks really, really good, but the Christmas tree is a little bit too much. I would prefer them to do a custom cut gradient of green to red. Uh, oh, well, but uh, easy install, simple to do in about 30 minutes. Thanks for watching, and I'll link to these in the description below. Right safe for everyone.